Glad I found you finally. So, first of all, let me introduce myself properly before the apologies. Emily. Oh, hi. I think I see the boys in two. Where they had a foolish one day. He's scared to death, I'm afraid. He's literally locked himself in the room, refusing to come out. Over. Oh, it's okay. So, for then, it'll be okay. See, go carry that stupid guy, come. You carry on, come out. Before I go listen to your apology, you hear? Oh, come on. He's just a kid. Me too, Abi Hey, what's up? I'm good, you? I'm okay. So, you're looking for me, right? Oh, too bad. Today is family day, so it's not a good time. But, what happened? I messaged you on Facebook after. Yeah, yeah. I ran out of credits. Oh, okay. So, will you call me or something? Yeah, but I don't have your number. Who are you? Thanks. You're welcome. But I have to be truthful to you about something. With that guy as a friend, you'll not be welcome in this house when you guys are together. I'm sorry, but I have to be honest with you. Oh, okay. Okay then. See you. Ciao. What's up? I came to do the favor you said you wanted me to do. What's it? See you. Finally, you can talk. You should have seen yourself in the mirror the other day. Anyway, I'm watching a movie with my family inside. Come and join us. What? Look, don't bring that here. Just come. You're all nice people, so come and join us. Well, me, my brother, my dad. You watch movies with your dad? Yeah, I do. Just come, he won't bite you. Come, come and join us. I have something to say. Actually, I also have something on my mind. Okay, shoot. No, you go first. No, you go first. Emily, come on, ladies first. No, I want you to go first. You are long. Heads or tails? Really? Okay, tails. Okay, heads is mine. If your shows, I go first and vice versa. Okay. I win. Why are you holding my hand so hard? I can't let you take your hand there. You're going too far. I can't let your hands go there. You can tell me the coin drop in my lap so you could go there, didn't you? <laughs> Emily, am I a boyfriend or not? Yeah, but you know for a girl the touch can go really far. Besides, my folks are around. Emily, come on. But it's not like you're tipsy or something. So if your folks weren't around? Cyril, if I give you a chance, you do it right. Answer me. Listen, I know you said you don't trust me in the past, but then I'll use a condom. So you would? It depends, okay? But as I said earlier on, I'll use a condom, so we're safe. How about we don't even do it at all? Let's go. Sir, is everything okay? Yeah, why? Can't you see what's going on here? She's obviously upset. What are you talking about? I'm a girl. I saw the way she looked at me. It wasn't cool. Whatever it is, she'll be fine. See that? Maybe you should go alone. No, Emily. Please, just go, okay? She didn't even say hello. I mean, who does that? I'll handle her. Yeah, that's not even necessary. You said you need the money, so just go and have your meeting with them. You don't need me around. I do, okay? Let's just go together. I'll tell her my peace of mind after all. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Please, come with me, Emily. Maybe you should tell her now. Irene, I need to have a word with you out here. You didn't reply my text, did you? But I know who she is. Oh, you do? She's your girlfriend. And what's your problem? Are you going to be nice to come and introduce yourself or you want us to call up the deal? 
Told me. Can I at least lie beside you? Go and lie on your own bed in your house. Come on, please. Look, I'm sorry about how things turned out today. Okay. I still think you shouldn't have left. <laughs> But I met up with her mom and the discussion went well. She's been commenting profusely on your Facebook and Instagram posts. Yeah. and student are in the making. How's that? Maybe you have a lot more explaining to do. Do you find her attractive? Oh, Emily, what's that? Uh, she's good looking, isn't she? What? Oh, you didn't hear me. Right now, she's in school, so her hair is natural. Can you imagine if she had the weave on and the makeup and all that stuff? What's all this, Emily? You haven't answered my question. Do you find her attractive? No. Get out of my room. Why me? I just go here. Leave. Oh, yeah, you're asking me to leave. No, just leave. <laughs> These kids are funny, yo. So now you can talk, eh? I was talking to myself. I'm still not talking to you. The fact that I'm sitting here with you doesn't mean I feel like talking to you. You already know what you've been up to. Emily, we debated that on WhatsApp last night when you sacked me from your room. That was on WhatsApp, but in person, I'm still not talking to you. Emily, you know what? You don't have an agenda with the boys, right? I only came here to ask if you're gonna go with me to the party. And I said no. And oh, no. Go with your new girlfriend, Irene. Ah, Emily. Emily. Yes. Really? Why am I still even talking to you? <laughs> I mean, who should, who should tell you, like, who should make it obvious to you? It's not because you love me. So you're in my way. Emily, how many times should I clearly tell you I have nothing doing with that girl? Tell her that in my presence and I'll believe you. Fine. You will? Yeah. So, you're going to call her when I'm around and tell her you have nothing doing with her? Emily, if that's what you want, I'll do it. <laughs> when? Anytime. Are you sure you called on me right now? Yeah, sure. You can check. Nah, that won't be necessary. If you could, at least assure me of those three words. You know what I mean, right? Is it funny? Oh, so you think it's funny? Come on, Emily. You know I love you. Yeah, me too. Anyway, where is he? Cyril, <laughs> why have you been avoiding me? So he did there. He's, he's just surveying the pool and tasting the water to make sure that everything is fine. Yeah? Can you take us to him? Oh yeah, shout. Hi. Hey. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Aha! Uh -huh. uh, Cyril! See, I'll go raise your woman come here. So why do you feel left my woman give me? Your woman this, where my woman that? You bab? Aha! Uh -huh.
Emily is past him. Oh, George. I'm picking up. Then call Cyril. What if he's so upset with me and he doesn't pick up? Okay, he doesn't have my number, so let me call him. George, can you please pick that up? You can toss it in the bin when you get home. Hey, practice good sanitation. You are right, you are right. You are looking for a serial net. See, serial is normal. Serial is normal. He has gone to the club. Eh? But the good thing is, I know where the club is. So I can take you as soon as you are ready. Okay? Mm -hmm. Mommy, what do you think? I told my folks I won't be out for long, so... Yeah, me too. My mom's probably worried about me. George, I don't think we can go to the club with you today. You're not even wearing the right outfits. Oh, but who tell you say they need right outfit to go to club? You girls are looking smashing already. Look, and see, are you going to the club for the club or you're going there to look for Sarah? No, but still. Okay, you know what? Have you called him? Have you called his phone? No, I don't want to call him. I just want to see him and hug him goodbye and wish him well. Charlie, love goes with you. <laughs> see, now you are back to the Emily I know. Eh? Right? You go default settings. The nice girl you've always been. Okay? Look, don't worry. Then I'll let him come over to your house tomorrow. How about that? Promise? Ah! <laughs> you are not a promise and fellow. Why do you think they call me King George? Eh? Because I always deliver. Besides, what are friends for? Why are you back already? So is this how you welcome my friend who has been away for two weeks? Oh, come <laughs> here. I miss you. <laughs> oh. Hey, you're looking fresh, oh. You really went to chill. Yes, because I was close to nature. <laughs> I know, right? So we should come and see how fresh you're looking, that boy. The way you regret, eh? Leave Cyril alone, oh. I put pride aside and went to see him last night after I got back. Can you believe he was not around? He had gone to the club. With who? How would I know? Anyway, good for him. I, mean, I just wanted to say goodbye, so I left a message with George. Can you believe he still hasn't called me back? Wow, oh, uh, look. So why bother? Oh, how is George? <laughs> I miss him more. We've been chatting on WhatsApp. You tried this thing. Hey, hey, don't look at me like that, though. I didn't mean it that way. George is just interesting to be with, that's all. Nothing more. Hey, you guys can't let go of each other. You've been hugging for about five minutes. I missed you. I missed you too. And they won't mind me too. I actually thought it was over between you two all. So, you guys are back together now? We never broke up, Emily, did we? No. Oh, this is so sweet. You guys will make me cry. Do you have any plans of going back to the States? No, nah, not for now. I got too lonely over there. I actually told my mom I want to go and continue my uni over there. Really? And what did she say? Instead of I pass the flying colors. Well, I have no doubt you would. But that's not all that she said, you know. What else did she say? She knows I have a girlfriend. I mean, that's you. And so far as I don't break your heart and I don't get you pregnant. Oh, so she knows about me now. Yes, she does. What does she think of me? <laughs> she hasn't said anything yet. Well, as for the pregnancy bit, I'm sure you told her she has no cause to worry because we are abstaining. I did. You know, because of what has happened before, what my friend and Jogba and my friend Jogba and I used to do. So she didn't really believe me, but. Oh, okay.
cake that night. Go ahead. Do you remember that restaurant that you brought me to on our third date? Third date? Let me remind you. How was the music? Did you enjoy it? Yummy. Thanks for reminding me to eat a healthy way. I'm glad you did. Yeah, so can I ask you a question? Oh, yeah, sure, why not? At that first meeting in front of my house, were you shy of me? Emily, where's this question coming from? You were shy, right? Well, it was a big surprise. A big surprise that? <laughs> that a beautiful girl like you, you know, just showed up out of nowhere. And I was just so confused. Why? I didn't even know the reason why I was there. <laughs> you know, I was just so confused. You were just so beautiful. <laughs> The guys won't stop laughing. You know, they laughed at me the whole day. <laughs> but why did you tell your friend? I didn't tell anyone. You know, Joba was there, right? Yeah, that guy. Just grabbing your hand, too. Happy now. You know, this is enough proof that you yourself are shy. Maybe we are both shy. <laughs> You're saying it's no big deal, but do you think Zero will carry a condom in his pocket? Hey, how would I know? No, but Emily, this is not funny. This is embarrassing to me because people already think he is my boyfriend. Ah, Mamiya, Emily, Ruby, hi. Hey, George, where's your kid sister? She's left. Oh, she's so lovely. Can I have a number? Wait, number? <laughs> Look, me and my house, we don't give small, small girls phone, so. Ah, but my kid brother is her agent. He has a phone. Shall I, you, you guys are the beast. You, I mean, if you want to talk to her, you either call, call my line so that I'll, I'll, I'll give it to her. Fine. The actual truth is, I'm trying to get her the new iPhone 7 S refurbished in rose gold. You understand? So as soon as it comes, I mean, I could let you have the number. Anyway, it was nice meeting her and everyone else. It was super nice meeting you too, okay? Yeah. I have to run. Eh? Bye, everyone. Bye. Now I know you like him. See, you're jealous just because he's with another girl. Why should I be jealous? They are not dating. So then why didn't you? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Oh! <laughs> so, when did you get back? Just last night. Why didn't you tell me you were coming? Look at your faces. It's supposed to be a surprise. Come on. I'm welcome, man. I want to relax. Maybe you told me you sort the VIP out. Really? I already went to check out the place. Come on. Oh, you sure? Of course. Oh, you go check the VIP out. I want to check out the place. Oh, I got a prank for you and I want to find out. Really? Yeah, I'll try for you too. I'll try for you too. It's on silent. The phone's on silent. Yo, yo, yo. Won't you pick up? Nah, there's no one important. There you are. Where have you been? I've been looking all over for you. Charlie. Yo, I brought me to call me ass. Where have you been? I've been looking all over for you. Charlie. Yo, my guy, my grandma made it for me. It's all over for you. Where have you been? Yo, yo. And why did you leave me all alone at the VIP section? Who is she? Who are you? Look. Look, you asked me, look. I'm his wife. So, Cyril, is this the reason why you left me all alone at the VIP Listen, section? Listen, you're going to respect my girlfriend, right? I already told you I have a girlfriend, and you respect my decision, oh, okay? Please, what? Please, what? Sarah, you know what? No, 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 no. I'm no, 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 not today. Ruby, let's go. Sarah, I thought you've changed. I have, come on. Let her go. Why, Jasmine, why? Huh? Are you really going after her? Yeah. Cyril! Yeah. What? I mean, we are planning my pote. I plan this thing. Take your diet and mess Oh, please. Me, oh, please. But I get out. I won't go anywhere. You know who I did there. Emily, wait, oh, 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 
hold up. Oh, What's up? One. Look, it's not what it seems, okay? Please. It's always not what it seems with you. You didn't even tell me you were back. I wanted to tell you, trust me, but George made me feel like it would be best if you meet me at the party. I would have called you, trust me. Oh, so you just got back last night and you already have a girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. She's a family friend's daughter. She's only staying with us for a short while, please. And what about both of you? Absolutely nothing. It's you I want to be with. She's living in your house. Look, it's, it's, not what it, it's not what it looks like, okay? Her mom is out of the country. So during that period, that's why she's, she's with us, nothing else. If she's so comfortable to call herself your wife, it seems to me that your mom approves. Why don't you go be with her? No, 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 no. Come on. Emily, no. Listen, it's you I want to be with. Trust me. Cyril, excuse me. Emily, listen, look. I love you, okay? This is the honest truth. I love you. This is me. Cyril, if you don't leave, I would scream for my dad to come out. <sighs> I can help you do that. Ah! What next? That's not funny. Look, Emily, I understand, okay? I know I should have called you, but hey, relax. If I wanted to be with a girl, I wouldn't be here. It's you I want to be with, please. I hear you. Can I leave now? I said, no pay me. Ah, boss, relax. I'll give you a... Oh, Emily. See, see, see. Boss, what? Emily, Richard. I was surprised to see your call. Well, George came by my house this morning. George? Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. What? Nothing. I was just a thank you. Yeah, and she had to call you dear. Do I have to tell you she was only trying to be nice? Yeah, right. <laughs> Why are you laughing? It's just sweet. What's sweet? Look, you're jealous. I'm not jealous. Mm -hmm. Look at your face. It's obvious. Okay, 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 maybe. But I won't be if you stop flirting with all these girls. Don't you think you should know me better by now? I mean, since the first day that I met you at your gate, I haven't set my eyes on any other girl. But you mean something to her. I don't care how she feels about me. I don't feel the same way. What I care about is how you make me feel. Oh yeah, just you talking. Because that's the truth. I don't know what's worse. She been to you or she living in your house. It's not your headache. Stop worrying too much. Her mom will be over by the weekend and she's gone for good. For really? Good. Yes. <laughs> wait, so let me ask you this question. How long are you going to make me wait at the aisle? Be honest with me. Mm, two hours. Two hours? Really? <laughs> How long are you even going to do makeup? Come on. Okay, 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 okay. Just one hour. <laughs> Come on, even one hour is too much. You know it. Emily? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. God. Ah, it's been so long. I know, where have you been? I've been around, I bet you don't look for me. Let me introduce you. Abeku, this is Cyril. Cyril, this is Abeku. We used to sit at the same desk back in high school. <laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. Let's go and take a picture. You look so nice. I've missed you so much. I want to show my mother how beautiful you have become. Come on. <laughs> Hey. So I'm just Cyril now. You couldn't even introduce me as your boyfriend. I'm sorry. Wow. Oh. You're telling me there's somebody you just sat at the same desk with? Yeah. And his mother knows you? Yeah. Wow. Wait. <laughs> Cyril, are you jealous? Me? Not at all. I'm fine. Me? Not at all while I'm fine. You're so jealous right now. <laughs> hey, admit it. Hmm. Admit it. You are jealous. This guy. Just, just a little. Oh, he's just a friend. Don't you don't you don't have a reason to be jealous. Missed you. So, are you still in bed? No. Nah. All right, I'm off to work. Okay, mom. Come along the main gate. Okay. Yeah. Mommy's boy. I'm not a mommy's boy. Yes, you are. You're mommy's boy. You know something? Why don't you come and keep me company till you go to class? Is it because you're alone at home? Come on, Emily. It's not what you're thinking. Yeah, it's not what I'm thinking, but it's what you'll be feeling when I get there. It's okay, don't come. Oh, why? 
You both. Uh, not at all. Um, through my mom calling me. I'll call you back. Okay. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Mommy, I'm coming. I need a move on. What do you mean by what am I doing here? Where's your phone? Didn't you see my call? Your mom also called. This is it. This is it. Anyways, my mom asked me to leave this stuff with Auntie and you know. I'm maybe late for my interview. From there, I'll just go back to Kumasi. Today? Yes, today. No, 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 wait, 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 no, no, no. no. You? The first time I did my eyes on you, I knew that there was something special about you. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I just don't know how to describe it, but you've always had this effect on me. I do? Yeah. Wow, I'm flattered. I'm just being honest here. So, is that what you wanted to tell me? As a matter of fact, no. Then what is it? Why are you keeping me in suspense? I'm not. I just don't know how to say it. It sounds silly. I actually came there because I had a misunderstanding with my girl and you were at the verge of breaking up. When I saw you two together, it just made me realize how much I love her and I went and patched things up with her. Wow. See, I told you it sounds silly. Oh no, it's actually very sweet. Thank you, thank you. Well, I don't know what is going on between but I could clearly see that the love between you guys was genuine. And in this crazy world where people are looking to use people, that is not the love that you throw away. Hello? Hi, how are you? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. It's been a while. I miss you. I've missed you too. So, how are you spending your vacation? I've been posted to teach in a school in the north. North K? No, north in region. Wow. How's that going? Uh, so far, so good. So, when will you be returning? But when the next semester resumes. That's about a month away. Oh. Okay, cool. All the best, okay? Sure. Thank you. Thank you, too. Bye. Oh, you got it. Yeah. Emily, I think Cyril is in this hotel. Really? Or well, you knew about it? No. Well, I saw his friend Psycho. Psycho? Who Psycho? Psycho, the guy who likes Ruby, the one who got drunk at Cyril's graduation. <laughs> yeah, I remember that guy. Oh. Suddenly, my heart is beating. I wasn't expecting to see him this soon. What do I do if I run into him? Calm down. That would be awkward though. All of us in the same hotel. I know, right? Maybe we should move to another hotel. Like seriously? Oh. Like I said, this is a love show. I'm done with your shoe and I put it in a box. Then I beat the love drums, right? What's funny? You two was funny. Wait, so you came all the way to Tamale just to mimic me, huh? Who said I came to Tamale because of me? My instincts never lie. Well, then this time is deceiving you. Are you serious? Bye, bye, bye. <laughs> so you tell me, what's the main reason why you're here? I'm on vacation. I'm exploring the motherland. Exploring the motherland. The big old motherland. And you didn't find yourself anywhere but where Cyril is? It's a coincidence. Just a coincidence. Yeah. Okay, if you say so. How long have you been here? Just a couple of months. You said it's a voluntary service, right? Yes, yes, yes. One of my lecturers works with an NGO. So every year they send some students to selected communities to help. That's nice. It suits you. You're such a good role model. So one of the things I admire most about you. You're making my head big. Are you blushing? I declare. I'm a Miss Boy. Not a mommy's boy. Mommy's boy. <laughs> but I've missed you.
bought you something, right? You did? What is it? On my way back, I decided to get it for you. But with all the chaos that's going back home, I decided not to give it to you at the wrong time. But this looks like the right time. What is it? Are you ready? Yeah, just you show me. Up? Close your eyes. Close, Close my eyes. Close. Open it now. Cyril, what's this? Oh, she likes her. Where's the 